Another Thanksgiving tradition, getting ready for Black Friday. And this year, it started very early. Our gadget guy in the thick of it over at Best Buy. Best Buy opened its doors about six hours ago. And there's still stuff on the shelves. Absolutely. Why not, right? People are still stopping by. Uh, I, I fortunately got a little nap in between, but uh, everyone else here seems to have been up and, and going without a problem. Uh, you know, a lot of people uh, picking up these flyers today and looking at those deals going, whoa, lots of great deals. Uh, you know, one of the best ones, obviously, the 199 42-inch uh, TV. Unfortunately, that one did sell out within just a few minutes this morning. Um, we talked uh, in the 5 o'clock hour about uh, things that are great deals and things you should buy. There's actually some things that on Black Friday you want to wait have a little patience for because they actually uh, will pay off in the end in terms of lower prices. One of those toys, so you see some toys here, mm -hmm. um, you think when you're going out, you know, you see all these great toys and the kids are out there with you and it's a lot of fun, you're saying let's buy the toys. What you'll find, yeah, you're going to get a good sale uh, today, but actually uh, dealnews.com says your best bet with toys is going to be in a couple weeks, about two weeks before Christmas is when they have the biggest discounts on toys. So you might be happy getting that price today, but you might be a little bit more disappointed in two weeks when it's uh, discounted. Um, Talk about TVs. Uh, typically, we see those off-brand TVs, uh, the Dynexes of the world, the Westinghouses, things like that, that are on sale today. And those are deeply discounted and a great deal. Uh, but if you're one of those that wants to get one of those name-brand TVs, like right. a Samsung or a Sony or something like that, if you tend to wait a few more weeks, again, about the second week in December is when you start to see those get discounted the most. And that's historically speaking. So, um, you know, to, I'm not going to say put all your money on that, but uh, when it comes to other Black, Black Fridays of the past, it's been cheaper in December to buy those name brand TVs. Uh, 2012 calendars you want to wait closer to January to get to uh, as well as Christmas decorations. It's fun right now we want to put them up but if you're really looking to get the best bargain the closer you get to Christmas of course the more deeply discounted those will be and after Christmas as well that's going to be uh, the deal. Um, but there are some uh, apps out there and some other ways that uh, you can use the online world to help you with your shopping this morning and mm -hmm. coming up in the six o'clock hour I'll give you a little bit uh, some tips and tricks on how to use those technologies sure to help you get the best bargain. So let me ask you one thing, Steve. There, there is a question from our crew here on yes. the uh, on the laptop computers are, are that are on sale. Are are those name brand ones or? The yeah, cheaper? they are. You know. So uh, I haven't checked in now in the last half hour, but as of the five o'clock hour, uh, there were still the $179 Lenovo laptops that were on sale. And Lenovo is actually a reputable brand. They're a spinoff from IBM. So those business IBM computers of the past, they've changed now into a new name called Lenovo. So not a bad brand. And you've got Samsungs, you have HP out there. So lots of great name brands. Again, in laptop world, I would definitely stay with a brand that you know and trust, but there are plenty of those out there and plenty of those discounted. So come on in. Okay, thanks for answering that question for us. We'll let you. <laughs> You're welcome. We'll get let you get back by uh, back to buying and whatever, and uh, we'll check back a little later. Sounds good. Thanks, Steve.